Welcome to Optimized, and in today's tutorial, we will be showing you how to set up personal name servers. Welcome to another video. My name is Ryan, and I will be your host today, and I am going to show you how to set up personal DNS uh, servers in Namecheap specifically. So this may vary from uh, registrar to registrar, but I host with HostGator. I just upgraded to a VPS from a shared reseller plan. So I need to uh, update all my domains DNS so they are pointed at my new improved hosting service because that was the whole point of making the switch. So if you're in um, Namecheap, if you're hosting with Namecheap, I mean, any kind of regular domain you can get for about 10 bucks if you have Honey. Uh, the little extension up here they usually save you a couple bucks and it's like 10 bucks and you get the private uh, Privacy on the domain and all that kind of stuff. So I haven't found a better place to get Domains, so I put most of my domains here. So you, you're gonna want to go to domain list. I Am currently working on nursingconfidential.com. So I'm gonna go to manage and When this comes up, I will go to advanced DNS right here and this is where we need to add our personal DNS server as noted right there so it gets a little confusing I read all the documentation and was thoroughly confused so what you need to do is click add name server and I have my email from HostGator right here that has my new DNS and you will also need the IP address associated with your personal DNS so I'm gonna take my first one right here, my NS1, copy that, and we're gonna go back to, oh, let's go to the right screen here, and we're gonna go, and you type that in, or you paste that in, but then you have to click right here. If you don't click right here, it doesn't get it. So click right there, we got it, and we'll go back to here, we'll grab this, so we'll grab the IP address associated with that one, and we will slap that in there and you click done. So this is where, you know, it gives you the little notification up here, but you see nothing. So that is what was really throwing me off. So we'll come back and do the same thing for NS2. Copy that. Hop back over to Namecheap. Paste that in. You got to click right here again. Boom, it's got it. We'll go back and grab that IP address. Got that, come back, paste it in there, done. Okay, success. And now, see, you go to, uh, maybe let's try this. Search, nope, can't even search that, but this is what was tripping me out. I'm searching, and I guess because I just entered them, they're not even showing up in here. So that's why I read all the documentation a million times. I had to get on the little chat with Namecheap, and I finally figured it out. But that's half the battle get your personal DNS set up in the advanced DNS and then you need to come back and update it right here so we'll need to grab our name servers again so I'll grab that one come back over here and paste that in and I'm just going to paste it in again and change that to a 2 and then I click check as in save and it is really that simple so <laughs> you get the confirmation up here don't do anything for 90 seconds. And that is it. It is really so simple once you uh, understand how their little funky system works right there. So I hope that really helped because <laughs> it cost me about two hours trying to figure out how to do that. So I hope I saved you a little bit of time. If you like the videos, please remember to like and subscribe. We have all kinds of tutorials coming on everything about WordPress, SEO, uh, Divi specifically, and just in general we're getting really good at google web designer so there aren't very many videos on that and i think that's going to become a really popular thing in the near future because we are making some slick animated ads to run on double click um and ad <laughs> adwords although they just changed all their uh all the google advertising just rebranded so i don't even know if they're called anymore but Hopefully they're better than they were because I could not stand them in the past, but whatever. Uh, that's all. I wanted to keep it short. I hope that helped. Until the next video, 
Hope you enjoyed. Have a great day.